But do you think, though, assuming, and I understand that there has been no Israeli confirmation or denial of the fact that this man was assassinated in Dubai at the hands of Mossad and that, for, and that forged passports were used. Assuming that that was the case, do you think, though, that the policy Look, of... My um, lady, excuse me again. This is... Wars are not a pleasant occasion. And I'm not an advocate of wars. I don't want to justify wars. I want to justify only the right to defend our lives. And when... And let me go even further, because uh, the answer they legitimized us, I want to ask about their legitimacy. Once that a lawful country has to face an unlawful organization, you are in power. Take your, you attacked, Europe attacked Kosovo. You killed 600 innocent people. You destroyed the Chinese embassy. I never saw that everybody suggested an investigation. There were events in Chechnya, in Afghanistan, in Iraq, in Somalia, in Darfur. Nobody ever dared to suggest an investigation. Why was Israel picked up? We were on the first to do so. And Why do you think Israel was picked up? I know, exactly. Because we are a member of the United Nations that has a built-in majority against us. For different reasons. I can't explain why there is anti Semitism. Why Israel, the Jews have tanks or bombs that endangered anybody. All the places the world, including Mr. Bloom, the world positive people. Why the hatred? Tell me. And why should I explain it? I think it's a non Jewish sickness. I think it's a shame. And I don't feel any need to explain shames and mistakes. But for us, it's not a deal. Would it be anti Semitism? Okay, we could explain it. But nobody paid a greater price for prejudices, for unfairness, for racism than our people. 